Steve Greenthal from Vector Mount. And here we're going to show you some of our pole mounting clamps. The clamps designed are to be versatile as possible. This is what we call our pro clamp. This will clamp from a three quarter inch diameter tube to a two and a half inch, or excuse me, two and a quarter inch diameter tube. And it does require four bolts for security. And at that point that they are mounted with this technique, they are basically bulletproof. The car will destroy itself and the clamp will still be in place. What you see mounted to it then is two different styles of mounting. This is our light duty hardware featuring our swivel mounts and our all aluminum componentry. Here you see it adapted to a quarter 20 tripod camera. We have the same adapter available for the GoPro. So a GoPro can go here or a tripod mount can go here. And you can see that it's tightened up with hardware. So by tightening up all of the componentry, this becomes very, very solid. This allows you also to have double camera mounts or even more if you like, because here we go to our heavy duty componentry. So this is three quarter inch aluminum threaded rod. And this uses half 20 threads of stainless steel to assemble it. So here you see a vector mount mounted, but anything can be mounted onto these stanchions. And again, it's a modular system. So if you need a 10 inch or a 12 inch or an eight inch, or you need extra knuckles, extra flexibility, you just add and build as an erector set system. So this clamp then, once installed, is basically impervious to anything. It does offer you the ability to attach three eighths hardware as well. It has three eighths threaded holes in it. It has mounts for our gimbal ball assembly, and it has mounts for the heavy duty and the light duty uh, hardware. So down here then you see another pro clamp turned the other direction showing how it can go in both directions. We are using it in this case for Freedom 360, a six camera GoPro rig, and then on the bottom we're using it to hold another GoPro. Here we have just multiple knuckles which is the same assembly over and over and over again and it gives us a very, very rigid mounting technique. So with that in mind, this is a way to clamp onto anything round in those diameter ranges to get a very, very robust mount that really will stay put once you're done with it.